Jamiroquai's bassist, Derek McIntyre, has tragically died in a car crash at the age of 66. The sad news was confirmed by his family and Hertfordshire police, with Jamiroquai's lead singer, JK, also expressing his grief. Derek McIntyre was not only part of the successful Jamiroquai album Dynamite, but he also contributed to music by Emily Sande, Will Young, and Beverly Knight. His family released a statement saying, Our dad, Derek McIntyre, was a proud dad, husband, brother, son, uncle, grandfather and friend. He had a passion for music, playing the bass guitar for most of his life and blessing tracks with his groovy bass line for folks such as Jamiroquai, Roy Ayers, Beverly Knight and many more. Dad was a great man who influenced many that came into contact with him, inspiring and encouraging every chance he could. They continued, no amount of words can sum up just how special our dad was to us all not only within our individual bonds, but as a whole. We will forever miss his love, humor and presence and will continue to spread his light. Until we meet again, Jay, the band's lead singer, shared on social media, it is with great sorrow that I hear the sad news of Derek McIntyre's passing. He was a joy to work with and a superbly talented musician. My thoughts are with his family, friends and fellow musicians who worked with him. Thinking of you at the great gig in the sky Derek. Jay, police are asking for help after Derek McIntyre, a much-loved man, died in a crash. The musician from Watford was in an accident on February 2nd and sadly died there. Early that day, police rushed to a crash on the A41. Detective Sergeant Craig Wheeler said, Our thoughts remain with Derek's family and friends at this sad time. Our officers are continuing to establish the full circumstances of this incident, and we are still appealing for information. If you were driving in the area and saw what happened, or have any dash cam footage that might help our investigation, please contact us.